All right, your MLB prize picks, man. Happy Tuesday, September 5th. Football started in two days. Um, but let's go. Um, oh, I've been following baseball all year. I've been dropping these videos for y'all. I've been um, studying. Like, I kind of need a break, honestly, man. So today uh, today be the last video till Thursday. I don't know what I'm going to do. I ain't going to promise nothing. I ain't saying I'm stopping baseball, but I don't know. Not stopping, but it's like towards the end of the season, it's hard to predict anyway because... Teams like uh, Sandy, St. Louis, you see they already pitch hitting for Arenado and Goldsmith. Like if they losing or if they winning. If they winning 8-3, they're not going to keep them in there. So, because they're not playing for nothing. So I just, I don't know. I don't want to keep giving you guys, I don't want to give you guys bad picks. I really did my research on these. And then, um, but here's the picks. So tomorrow it won't be no no baseball video for sure. I just need a day off at least, bro, before. Because football, I'm about to go hard, too. It's going to be two sports trying to keep up with both of them at once. And then, you know, basketball will start October 24th. That's real season, so. But I got uh, Adley Richmond over 7.5 hitter fantasy score against the Angels, against Detmers. Uh, not the best part for home runs, but I'll take Richmond. Um, that might have been. The list I was looking at probably was, it was from, like, Six, seven years ago, I think. So, I think the Angels did get a new stadium by then, but I, I don't know. I got to research it, but I like Rat Smith anyway. He got power. Like, Kenya Jr., definitely over uh, 10 fantasy score against, um, oh, what's his, Mikko? Mikko, or um, Mikola? I forgot his name for the St. Louis. Then I got Brady Singer over four uh, pitcher strikeouts. Um, I actually got him uh I gotta edit my line. I got one line with Strider for the twenty thousand on FanDuel, and I got one line with Strider, uh, Singer. So the line with Singer got better players, obviously, because he's cheaper, cost wise, and then. Um, but the one with Strider is more like, okay, I hope these hitters come through. But then Aaron Judge at eight point five hitter fantasy score over. Um, there we go, man. So, Richmond over seven point five hitter fantasy score. Ryan O'Connor Jr. over ten fantasy score. Um. Brandon Singer over strikeouts over four and um Aaron Judge over eight point five. I could find no more. I try to get y'all like six just because I know some people bet big. I bet big, like I do six because you could do five dollars to win one twenty five. Or I know people that uh like you're not gonna agree with every pick I have. So some people might not be like, no, I ain't picking up Kenya Junior over ten. Blah, blah, blah. Like he, I don't think you go hit a home run. I mean, you know what I'm trying to say. Like if I get y'all six and y'all used to play four, at least y'all could pick the four y'all want. So. That's why I do six, but uh that's it. They got hits from the RBIs, but it's a combo. I don't like the I don't do I stay away from the combos. They got total bases. I went through all of those twice. Pitcher strikeout combo, I don't like combos, like I said, and then first hit run first inning hits allowed. I don't think it's the day to do that. Only cause uh the only aces on the mound is um there's some good pitchers. Lorenzen is good, because 'cause I'm a Tiger fan, so I know uh by uh Chris Bass is straight. Dean Kramer is straight. Y'all can end the video now if y'all want. But I'm just going through some extra stuff. Um, oh, the strikeouts anyway. That's just the wrong thing. I might look at this right here. I'm saying it ain't that many, like, stud pitchers. It's only, um, even what's name been struggling analysis. The Tigers hit um, Gary Cole pretty good. So that's why I didn't pick him. But that's it, man. If you ever sign up for prize picks, um, get that 100% deposit match piece.